Oh, I don't feel too good. Baby. Mm. Yeah. I think I'm a little bit sick. Oh, <laughs> why can't my body just be all healthy and work properly today? What would help make me feel better? Oh, I'm not really sure. That's a really good question. <laughs> I wish I could tell you, but I really have no clue myself. <laughs> I just feel so uneasy. <clears throat> I think I'm gonna close my eyes for a little bit. Is that okay, baby? <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so much understanding. It's not that I don't want to hang out with you. I just simply don't have the energy to do very much right now. Thank you, my love. Oh, <laughs> hi, baby. What's this? Oh, <laughs> You brought me snacks. Oh, you are so thoughtful. And they are my favorite as well. Oh my god, I love these so much. They are some of my absolute favorites. I can't believe you remembered. <laughs> I remember looking at them in the store and pointing them out. I didn't think you even noticed at the time. Mm, this is so special. You're gonna be making some food too. Oh my love. <laughs> you are treating me so well. You always make everything better. Next thing I need from you is just to go and beat up my immune system. And tell it to get its act together, so I can feel better soon. <laughs> yeah, that's what I need. Really, really bad, actually. And it's so exhausting to not feel well. And that's why it means so much to me that you're here. And that you all put so much effort into getting my mind off of it. And like, I remember, I remember one time when I was sick. And the first thing you did was, you brought out my Switch and you were like, Here, you have to play Animal Crossing. And it really did help, just getting my mind onto something else. And having permission to be sick. Like, you know, when you actually take time to get rest, and take time and allow yourself to feel better. That's not the luxury I tend to give myself. So having you here and having you insist that I take it easy, I can't even tell you just how much that means to me. Baby, I love you so much. Mm, I love you, I love you, I love you. <laughs> yeah, I know my forehead is getting pretty hot. <sighs> yeah, you're right. That's perfectly fine. And it's gonna go back to normal very soon. 
soon enough at least. And when it does, I'll have all my energy back. All of everything back. <laughs> all that mental capacity that I seem to lose whenever I'm sick. It just goes completely out the window. All my focus, all my energy, everything. And that's why it helps so much to have you around. <laughs> yeah, it really does. <laughs> I'm so jealous of your immune system. Now you're almost never sick. I want it so bad. You have to teach me your secret. <laughs> I want to be the same. I wanted to be a strong little fighter so I can just beat up anything that tries to get in my way. <laughs> uh, baby, I'm so excited for the food that you're gonna make. What are you planning on? Ah. <laughs> oh, sweetie. That's the perfect kind of food. Oh my gosh, such a nice and filling, warm, gentle meal. That's also easy on the tummy. You are so thoughtful. I can't get over it. I just want to give you the biggest cuddles and the biggest hugs I can. But I have to hesitate now. I don't want to risk getting you sick as well. <sighs> I'm not sure if it's the kind of thing that's contagious or not. Baby, I know you want to cuddle me too. And I love that so much. But it's probably best that we don't. I really don't want to risk your health. Mm, baby, I know that you're strong. Of course I know how strong you are. <laughs> you are the strongest ever. That doesn't change if I'm contagious or not. Or if I can make you sick. I would really never want to do something like that to you. And you see, the thing is, if I'm sick, and you're also sick, there's nobody to take care of the other person. We'll just both be laying on the ground, just... Uh, <laughs> unable to do anything. Anything at all. Oh, you're willing to risk it, are you? <laughs> My lovely, precious love. <sighs> you really are persistent, aren't you? Mm. You do make a really good offer. And you are right. I could just be facing the other way. And I could just be Little Spoon during our cuddles. Hmm. But my love, I don't want you to get sick. Really, I don't. Ah, uh, don't sus me. I sus you. Sus, sus, sus. <laughs> I guess you're right. I am starting to feel a little bit better. So, even if I make you sick, then I'll be all healed up by that time. Then I'll be all healed up by that time. And then I can take care of you. So we just swap. 
<laughs> Is that the plan? <laughs> I see. <sighs> well, I can't really move much. So, if you want to cuddle me, I guess I'll just have to deal with it. comfortable <laughs> baby <laughs> this was a really good suggestion I love you so so much <laughs> I think I think it's probably best if I just close my eyes for a little bit This is way too comfortable not to. <laughs> I love you. <laughs> and I love you so much. My eyes are getting pretty heavy. <laughs> We have no more energy to open up again until tomorrow. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna take a little nap. And I promise you, I promise you right now, that by the time I wake up, I'll feel at least, at the very least, 5% better, if not more. <laughs> Good night, sweetie. <laughs> Thank you so much. I love you 